It's really great to be here at the Chicago Marriott. Thanks for coming out today. The reason we are here, we've got a brand new movie called Until They Are Home. This started out 14 years ago when I met Eddie Albert, who was an actor uh, in the, the TV show Green Acres. He was in the Battle of Tarawa. We made a movie called Return to Tarawa with Ed Harris. Fortunate for me, there's a Marine standing here to my left, an Alderman Balser, that is very well known here in Chicago. He saw my film. He couldn't believe that there were still, he knew that there were Marines buried in Tarawa, but he couldn't believe that we couldn't come up with a paycheck to go out and bring these guys home. So he was obviously upset. He went to Congressman Lipinski and said, Congressman Lipinski, we got to do something about this. Sure enough, Congressman Lipinski, the great congressman here from Chicago, wrote the legislation. Not only did the legislation get passed, it was a federal mandate. So we went back out on a C-17 with Matthew Housley and my executive producer, Tim Shelton. We went out for 41 days. We followed the great works of JPAC, which is the Joint POW MIA Command. These are the young men and women that a lot of people don't know that are out in Vietnam, they're out in the World War II sites, they're out in Korea looking for our fallen. With that, I'm going to introduce the great Jim Balsa. Thank you. I'm, I'm honored to be here and as a uh, Vietnam veteran, uh, proud to have played a part uh, in this whole journey. Uh, I seen the movie Return to Tarawa, and I couldn't believe that there were Marines still buried on Tarawa. It was horrific for me to read this, that these men were left buried there. And we couldn't, as a government, come up with the money to bring them home? That is totally unacceptable. There should be a blank check for the recovery of all the remains of all the Americans who have died in the defense of this nation. We want this full and accurate accounting of all the Americans from all wars. We want their remains returned, and especially the ones from Tarawa. And I'd like to publicly acknowledge Congressman Lipinski for his work in this and for him to secure the money. And I hope this is a start in the full and total recovery of all Americans, no matter where they're buried. They should be brought back to their final resting place here in the United States. Don't miss until they are home. Memorial Day, May 28th, at the Directors Guild of America.